Hey guys, what is going on? It is Minidoff, and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to install the Pet Bats mod. So this mod has been gaining quite a bit of popularity over the past few weeks, days, minutes, seconds, milliseconds. And anyway, I was going to show you how to install this mod, and oh my goodness, this is like my 5,000th attempt of installing this mod. You know why? It's this freaking forge, man. There's like 5,000 different websites to get it from, and like 5 billion different versions, and... I was gonna rage quit, but I figured it out, and so I was like, I gotta tell people about this. They're gonna, and I'm saving all these computers from getting kicked in or something like that. So anyway, here we go with installation. This is the PC tutorial. I have a Mac tutorial already made. It will be up tomorrow, so expect that soon for all you Mac users out there, because I know I have a lot of my subscribers that use the Mac. And so let's go ahead and get started. I will have three links in the description. One for Pet Bats mod, one for Minecraft Forge, and then one for WinRAR, which I don't have a tab up here, but I should. But anyway, we're going to go ahead and go down here. So scroll down. This is the Pet Bats mod page, and you will see get it from my site as usual. So go to his website, and you'll need to scroll all the way down till you find Pet Mat. Pet Mat. Pet Bat. And they will go ahead and download it from Sugar Shink via. That's the best one I've found so far. And I've already got it downloaded as well, so you know you don't have to wait for me to download that. Also, the Minecraft Forge downloads page this pain in the butt right here so it seems this one seems to be working what i did was i went to this page i will have its files dot minecraft net and go here to latest and download the universal version so get the universal one and that will also download so go ahead and do that and then also if you're not using winrar then you can go ahead and get that but i will have a link in the description to that but i'm pretty sure all you guys have winrar already most people just get it like I get it the day I get my computer. I just you need WinRAR, or you cannot use your computer. So anyway, go do to your downloads folder, and you should have two things. You should have the Minecraft Forge and the Pet Bat mod. That is what we need. So we're going to install the Forge first, cause you need this to run this. It's kind of confusing, right? Wrong. It's easy. So first thing you need to do is go to your Minecraft folder. So you go percent app data percent down here in the bottom corner and then type that in and you should see roaming pop up here you can either click on that or press enter i like enter because the keyboard is a winning board yes use your keyboard it's better and then you can go into your dot minecraft folder but before we you know go ahead and start modding this thing up we're going to copy this to our desktop because if you make any mistakes here and you you know the minecraft won't launch which happened to me like 5,000 times you will need this backup and trust me you will need this backup make a backup copy paste this to your desktop trust me if anything goes wrong here you will thank me later okay so if this gets screwed up you drag this folder back in here and replace it and it should be all good there so then go into the dot minecraft folder and you should not have any of these files here like this this is just because i have optifine installed and what i'd recommend doing is force updating your minecraft before you even start doing this because Sometimes, you know, it just won't work. The mods will not be compatible. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to force update my Minecraft and I will be right back, okay? So if to force update your Minecraft, you just open up your launcher and then on the top, there's right before under the login button or above it, it's there's an options button. You click that and then you press force update and then log in. Or if you want to be lazy, you could just delete the bin folder. So I'm in, you know, my Minecraft folder, delete the whole bin folder and then start up Minecraft and it will automatically force update. So I'm going to do that and I'll be right back. Okay guys, I hope you saw that on the screen right here, it was just saying it was updating, and now we have the Minecraft Forge installed, all this stuff, and it says I have three mods, I don't know why, maybe I have the mouse mod, the keyboard mod, and the Christmas mod, I don't know, I don't have any mods installed, although it says I have three mods, but then we're going to need to quit the game, because we are still going to add one more mod before we go and quit out of this, and again, I am here in my Minecraft folder, so here's the .minecraft folder, and now there should be a cute little mods folder right here. So all you're going to need to do is drag in the pet bat mod into here. And I don't think you should have auto switch. I shouldn't even have that anyway. I don't even have that mod installed. So now that you've got that, so you've got the pets bat mod installed, just the zip file. Don't extract it. Leave the dot zip file in there. doesn't matter what the name is. It should just access all the files. So now you should be able to open up your Minecraft and it will work perfectly. But anyway, guys, that is going to be it for this video and I hope you guys enjoyed. So I will see you in the next one and I hope you have a fantastic day and stay tuned for the Mac tutorial, which will be coming out tomorrow and peace out.